What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. This is D from Desert Tactical. I'm out at the range today to zero and try out a new optic that I got from Primary Arms. This is the Primary Arms Classic Series RD25 Red Dot. All right, guys, so as I've mentioned before, I'm a huge fan of Primary Arms Optics. I think you get a lot for what you pay for. The RD25 was released late July of 2023, so it's still kind of newish. I've already made an unboxing and specs video, but just to recap, the Primary Arms RD25 comes in with a hard coat anodized aluminum body. It's got a push button system up on top to power the optic on or off and adjust the brightness settings. It has 10 brightness levels and it is night vision compatible. It runs on a single CR2032 battery with an advertised 25,000 hour battery life on a medium setting. It does not auto off or shake awake. Bummer, I know. The adjustment turrets are recessed and are set at a half MOA click value. The optic has a single 3 MOA red dot and a large 25mm window. It's fog and waterproof. The RD25 came in mounted on an absolute co witness QD Picatinny mount that has a single recoil lug on the bottom. If for some reason you don't like the QD mount included with this optic, any aimpoint micro footprint mount will work. Lastly, this optic is backed up by Primary Arms with a lifetime warranty. All right, so I decided to run the RD25 on my Palmetto State Armory AKP. I love this thing, especially now that we got these back. So I haven't zeroed in. I set up at 36 yards. Let's go ahead and take some shots. 762 by 39 Tula 123 grain FMJs. Let's see where we're at. Three rounds to conserve ammo. All right, let's check it out. All right, so first three rounds, I missed one. There's one right there and one right there. So we're low and to the left. Let's make some adjustments. Okay, so got it dialed in there in the center. Pretty good group as you can see there. Two shots touching each other. So zeroing in 762 by 39 is always a lot trickier for me than 556, but got it down. Let's run some drills. All right, so I wanted to run some drills, but I forgot my timer, so we're just gonna freestyle it. Beep. So far, so good with the Primary Arms RD25 Red Dot. Something I really like is that large 25 millimeter window. On top of that, I like that the opening on the mount is big enough for me to line up my iron. So I'm gonna take two shots with the optic, and then two shots with the irons. Pretty cool. So it's pretty sunny out today, and let me say that the brightness levels on the RD25 are very well balanced. No issues there. All right, a couple rounds on paper here. We're out. Reload. And one steal. All right guys, so the optic is plenty bright. The mount's holding on perfectly well. I love that it's QD, so in case the optic goes down, you can either remove it or use your irons through the opening of the mount. Pretty cool setup, you guys. No issues so far. Let's keep running it, see how we do. All right guys, so I'm about 100 yards out. Let's bring some steel with the RD25 and the AKP. Mm. 
Nice. Knock the target down. All right, guys, wrapping it up on my initial run with the primary arms RD25 red dot. It's a fantastic optic. I really like it. It's in the budget side, but it's really nice and it works very, very well. No issues whatsoever today. So I think it's going to live on this AKP, at least for the time being. So that is it, you guys. Thank you for watching. As always, I appreciate your support. Make sure to like, drop a comment, and subscribe if you haven't. Catch you guys next time. Peace.